The Philadelphia Phillies hosting the New York Mets, and the Mets are plus 140 on the money line. The Phillies are minus 160. The over-under is 8.5 runs. The Phillies laying a run and a half are plus 130. The Mets getting a run and a half are minus 150. Now, Mego pitched against the, uh, the Phillies once last year. He went... Four and two-thirds innings, gave up four runs. They were all earned. He got the L, and they lost the game 5-3. to three. Now, Wheeler pitched five times against the Mets last year. He had three, lo- uh, three wins and two losses. No, he had three wins, one no decision, and one loss. So, he did okay against the Mets. He went six and a third, seven, seven. He did pitch a complete game, and he went five, and he gave up a combined eight runs in all of those games. Now, what I meant to say was the Phillies went three and two in those games which he pitched. Now, head to head, the home team six and four. The home team's on a two game winning streak. The sa- the favorite is on a seven game winning streak. The team getting runs is six and four in their past 10 games, and the under is nine and one. I'm gonna take Philly with the money line. I'm gonna take the Mets with the runs again, and I'm gonna go under eight and a half. Let's see if I'm right. Let's see if I'm wrong.